One home run for Roberts. He bats from the left side. Runner goes from first. Ground ball through the right side. Base hit. This will score Lindauer. No problem. Uh, advancing all the way to third is Kazmarski. It's quickly 1-0 Waterloo. Strike here. 3-2 pitch on the way. It is way up and outside. And Suki will pick up his seventh RBI on a bases loaded walk to tie the game here in the third inning. 1-0 pitch. Hit well by Suki to left field. This one is way up, and this one is way gone. A grand slam for Michael Suki. Six to one, and Michael Suki has broken it wide open for the Wilmer Stingers. A grand slam in the bottom of the fourth. Michael Suki got into that one. It was a pitch over the heart of the plate. The wind's blowing out to left field as well, so when he got it up into that jet stream, it had some power behind it. That one was no doubt about it going to clear the fence. A grand slam, and the Stingers now have six runs, seven hits, and a five-run lead over the Waterloo Bucks. Illuminating point of the conversation said simply, hey, you can do whatever you want as long as you get to the same position as the pitch is delivered. That's what Alday does, and here he lines one into left center field for an RBI single. Alday now three for four in the ball game. And the Stingers lead seven to one. So far, all 10 hits for the Stingers have come from the first five batters of the inning. And this one will be number 11. Kenny Roberts deep to left center field and way out of here. His second long ball of the season. And it makes it eight to two. The Stingers have their sixth run lead back after Kenny Roberts goes deep to left center.